गर्भो बहु जगज्ञा हर्षसो गिवर्तन सुगत गोस्वामी सप्तम गर्भ सेवंथ होम इज वैष्णव धाम वैष्णव धाम मीन्स कैन अंडरस्टैंड एनिथिंग मैरस द होम बेस ऑफ वैष्णव वर वैष्णव वैष्णव धाम दिस अनंत देव इज काम अनंत When this seventh room of Devaki was there, at the same time, Vasudeva's second wife Rohini was also pregnant. She was also pregnant. When Vasudeva saw the pregnancy of Rohini, he sent her to Nanda Gopal. Said her pregnancy because Kansa was feeling everything, all the sons born. In tenth canto, Sri Madhav Bhagavatam, second chapter, you'll find the Supreme Lord says to Jogmaya, "You please go, Devi, O Devi, O Bhadre, you." Immediately go to Nanda Gopu. There was Vasudeva's second wife Rohini, and Devakya Dutare Garam Sesa Kham Dham Mamga, and the Om of Devaki. There comes my Dham Ses, Ananta Ses. And you take away that womb and attract Garuda Sankar Sankarsan, attract that womb and place it in the womb of Roy. That was Arak Krishna. So that Arak Jogmaya. In that womb of Devaki. Comes Baladev, ah, uh, whose one portion is Anantadev, one of the portions of Anantadev, who carries the whole universe in one of his hooves, like a mustard seed, like a mustard seed. Then all the universes, all the gigantic universes, he carries it in. In one of his words, like a mustard, source of his name, source of his mustard, you understand. And also, he, like Anantade, has innumerable mouths, innumerable. And with his innumerable mouths, he is always in sincerely engaged in glorification of Krishna, but cannot finish. For unlimited time. Is going on, going on, going on. Cannot finish such unlimited glory. This is not good. This uh, Balaram, Lord Balaram, is the son of Rohini. Is Rohini not them? And but why he came past in the womb of Devaki? That is the question. And why that womb? Was transferred again to Rohini. That was the question, isn't it? This question should be solved fast. You understand? Because Lord Balaram always serves Krishna. He is a servant of Krishna. Anir ki khota swam bolo de ek mahasa jar bhav sudha sattva vasule ti bol. Teha apna ke koren das bhavana. कृष्ण दास भी ना अच्छे कौन जाने छोटे जो काम तो सही है हाँ but to speak of others even more than who is the first expansion of Krishna who is always with Krishna the brother you understand when Krishna came as Chaitanya Mahaprabhu he came as brother who is the Nithai you understand is always 
আমের কি কথা সম্মানে
the asana is seat vyajana hand vyajana chama you know chama chama paduka is shoes paduka upadhana is pilo pilo upadhana chatra umbrella boshan is garments bhusha is ornaments jagya sutra sacred thing these are ten forms of cholera sarsas yes sir such a devotee is such a devotee of this lord yes sir krishna will come in the umba vas the krishna will come in the umba the baki so he passed him to prepare bed for him yes sir prepare bed mm. then jogamaya bazar by krishna jogamaya remove that boom when the seventh month at the month seven jogamaya removed that om and placed it in umba rohini who was in nanda goko then stand at that time then stand i said when rohini was sent to nanda goko she was three months pregnant pregnancy at that time three months pregnancy then stand Mm. When Jogamaya removing that womb, place the womb. At that time, Rohini was in deep sleep. She couldn't stand anything. She felt as if it's a dream. So open up. You understand? Here, one question arises. Consecrate the six sons of Devaki, one after another. Then the seventh one, brother, comes. You understand? A consecrate cannot kill the seventh one, cannot kill the eighth one, but he kills the first six ones. You understand? The first six sons. You understand? Who are these six sons, and why were they killed? You understand? They were not Vishnu Bhattas. So they are killed. They are material sons, not spiritual. So question arises: How is it that these material sons come in the womb of Devaki? Whose womb is Sudarshana? Most important question. And how is it? Huh? And Gansa killed them. What is its answer? It's very confidential, thought bro. You understand? And how they stay in the womb of Devaki? Whose womb is Sudha Sattva? Huh? Can any material being stay in Sudha Sattva? Of course, we cannot stay. Huh? But how? How is it? We cannot conceal the obviousness. But you can think of this thing when there there is complete annihilation, Mahaprabhu, isn't it? So where do the all jivas rest? They rest in the body of Mahavishnu, isn't it? They all rest there in the body of Mahavishnu. When the gen creation is is there, they come out as they are, as they were, isn't it? So the one more thing, all right. When they enter into the body of Mahavishnu, so they are liberated. So why they came out again? Huh? Isn't it? There is another question. How can you think about these things? So it's inconceivable. But you should understand. Though they rest there, still they are on remain on trust. Remain on trust. You understand? Yes, they, they are not trust. Ah. And in Gita also you'll find Krishna said that the Mastani Sarvabhutani Nantam Deva Vastita. Krishna said that the huh? Mastani Sarvabhutani. All the eliminated entities are there in me. Huh? Nantam Deva, but I am not in there. 
Isn't it? Huh? It is like that? Yes, it is. Huh? But when, how is it? The living and dead in the body of Krishna. How they become conditioned? How they again, when then the next creation they came out as a conditioned soul? Huh? You see? Puzzling, confusing. One may puzzle and confuse. What is this? I cannot think of this thing. You understand? And Krishna said that thing. Mastani sarva mudani no tam esva vastito. Similarly, huh? they remain untouched. So, the six sons, material sons came in the Sula Sattva Umba Devaki, but remain untouched. You understand? Remain untouched. So, they are killed by Tansa. You know? And all these things took place by the Jogi Surya of Krishna. It's Jogi Surya. Inconceivable, you cannot conceive of it. Then one topic of Siddhanta is here. Mm. Krishna comes, at least incarnations come here and manifest. They are leaders, transcendental leaders here. Why? Huh? Why? Though Krishna has said that. Jadadadahi dharmasya, glani bhavati bharata, ahyutthanava dharmasya, tadapmanu slamyam, parichana ya sadhana, vinasaya cha dhasrana, dharma sanstapana thaya, sambhavami, jige jige, for chapter Bhagavad Gita. This is the purpose. But most important chief reason is to give pleasure to his devotees. That is chief. Others are secondary things. Gauna. You understand? This mokya. See, to get pleasure to his devotees. That is the main reason. You understand? How are the devotees? What is their devotion? How they are mad after it? That way. I was chanting. Sahi premium they are so ecstatic, so intoxicated with their frame. Frame of this, they cannot and uh, uh, not anything else than this. Bhakti of the dosa, jeprokha, kusnata, samyakana bari ujite. But to speak of others, even kusnata cannot understand what is bhakti's uh, condition. Do you understand? That's Bhakta's condition. How is it intoxicated? Is it pray? How is it mad after it? I cannot understand. Then he develops greed for it. Krishna becomes greedy. <clears throat> huh? Krishna becomes greedy. How I can test it? How I can release this thing? But how can he release his rasera bisoy? His bisoy vikraha. Isn't it? His rasera bisoy. How can he release? Only those are rasera asroy. They release. Rasera bisoy can release. So that remained unpotent. It's remained unpotent. The desire not. It's not perfect. Krishna Vasco Viraj Goswami writes in Jaitan Jatanta. Vahe lobha thakka thakki, lobha thakka thakki. Lobha means greed. Do you understand? It's greed, the word. This very appropriate usage of these words are here. Lobha thakka thakki. Thak 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 thak. You might have seen when you cook they say, uh, what do you say, jau? Huh? Rice, you see. Uh -huh. At first the end, last part it becomes thak 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 You see, you can understand from this uses. This low greed is so intense. How can I release this? That 
نخوری گیم از کارا نجمی پکت و بار پکت و بار ادروائیز هکن ادروائیز جنسه سو تو سو دی لاست لیمیت پکتی آبادی پوری پاکی لاست لیمیت او پاکتی وات ایز دی لاست لیمیت او پاکتی پیم باکتی دی سو دیز دی Kusna kans, ali zin kade sans kam, hier, this material world, and manages that transcendental viras. Nothing else is there. So, those are sadhakas. Sadham bhakti, then bhava bhakti, then prema bhakti. Three stages you have. First stage is sadham bhakti. Doing sadhaka. You understand? The sadhakas, they do sravan kirtan. You understand under the guidance of bona fide guru, acharya. You understand? And the jiva surupa hoi kusnen nitya das, that is jiva surup, real identity of a jiva, is it or not? Devote, sarfita of Krishna. But anyhow, it's now condition. So, Brahmana Ramite Kaur Bhagyavana jiva, Guru Krishna, Kripa te paaya, bhakti no paaya, jadu dhar. Fortunate, they come to this path of devotion and do bhakti sadhana. They are set guru, one of the ways of guru, and the day of care, they do bhakti sadhana. They do sravan kirtana di bhakti. Though they do, still, there are six, what you say, these types of bishak o vichaya. In, in homes, it may be in, in some cross path, in whom there is in some form of soul. This bishop of desire of enjoying bishop material in them is there. There are six, six types, six types, sort of six. Do you understand? Huh? There are like six enemies. Do you understand? They are like six enemies. Unless these six enemies are killed, you cannot attain the Sudhasattva stage. In other words, you cannot be able to make Krishna appear in your heart. Do you understand me? Huh? Do you understand me? Unless these six enemies are killed, you cannot attain the stage of Sudhasattva. Unless you attain Sudhasattva, how Krishna will appear? Impossible. Krishna has never appeared. Because Krishna is always in Sudhasattva. This is significant here. This killing of six sons. Do you understand? Killing of six sons. Do you understand? What are they? These are six. They say, Sattas, Parsa, Rupa, Rasa, Vangha. Five sense objects. Do you understand? These are five sense objects. Sattva, Sparsa, Rupa, Rasa, Gandha, plus your wicked mind. These are six. Do you understand? As I have approved, these are six. Unless these six are killed, you cannot attain. Your heart will not be in Sudha Sattva. How can you so love it? Do you understand? So these six sons are killed. This is significance. Here, this tattva is here. Prior to coming Lord Balaram, this six are here. You understand? This six are previously six sons of Marichi Muni. You understand? They are six sons of Marichi Muni. And they were cast so they came in the womb of Devaki and are killed by Kansa. You understand? And after a day, after Kansa killed them, where do they stay? They stayed with Bali Maharaj in Suddhara. You understand? They stayed with Bali Maharaj in Suddhara. Bali Maharaj, Laman de Pusti, he was there, he is there in Suddhara. They stayed with Bali Maharaj in Suddhara. So when Ram and Krishna came, Akrura went to Gopa, Braja Bhumi, and brought them to Mathura. You understand? 
Then Ram and Krishna came. They met their dev- mother Devaki. Then Devaki told them, Please, I want, I am so much a great. My six sons are killed, I want to see them. Please bring them back. Isn't it? Isn't it? Please bring them back. So Ram and Krishna went to Sutta and brought them back. Isn't it? They brought them back. When they, they were brought back, then Devaki Devi became so much. She developed this motherly affection. And naturally, the milk emanates from her breast. You understand? She gave birth to Krishna. But Krishna had not sucked her breast. Jasoda Astarundhaya. Krishna sucked the breast of Jasoda, not the breast of the mother. Isn't it? Huh? <laughs> Isn't it? Jasoda Astarundhaya. He is Jasoda Astarundhaya. <laughs> not stop. So when the six sons came back, so Devaki Devi had such affection, motherly affection. Naturally, the milk emanates eh, from her breast to pass. She allowed her youngest son Krishna to suck to it. Do you understand? First she allowed the youngest son Krishna to suck to it. Then she allowed the six sons to suck. Do you understand? Then when they suck this eh, breast of Devaki, they have been passed tested by Krishna, they are so fortunate, they immediately they are delivered. They went to the heavenly planets. So, Devaki is Bhakta. Is the body. Devaki is the body. So, Bhakta Bhakta. But Kansa? Bhayat huh? Kansa? Do you understand? Bhayat Kansa. 
कंस भयावता देव की भक्त अवतार कंस भयावता Jeeva Swami has mentioned all these things. 
Ah, I told this father was carried this whole universe as a source of ah, mustards in one of his words and always glorifying Krishna in unlimited mouths. Hmm. So, hmm. these three Purusha avatars, the Karnada Sai Vishnu, Garbhadara Sai Vishnu, and Kirodha Sai Vishnu, they come here to this material world. Eh? Karnada Sai Vishnu is Mahavishnu, is Prakriti, he is Antarjan Purusha of Prakriti. He only casts a glance over material nature, the by material nature becomes impregnated, isn't it? <laughs> so, this Karnanda Sai Vishnu, first Purusha avatar is Prakruti Antarjana, Prakruti Antarjana, you understand, who enters into Prakruti, impregnates him through this glass. Then from him comes Second Purusha avatar Garbhada Sai Vishnu, who enters into all Brahmandas, is Brahmanda Antarjani. Then third Purusha avatar Kirodha Sai Vishnu comes from second Purusha avatar, who enters into the heart of all living entities, is Jeeva Antarjani. You understand? So, Lord Parara, this portion and portion and portion of Lord Parara, this Antarjan Puru Paramatma, who is there in the heart of all living entities. You understand? And as long as this Paramatma is there in your heart, you understand? You are moving, you have some strength, everything you are doing. That is Paramatma's Kripa. This is merciful strength in Kaukas. This is merciful strength unto you. That is Baladev's Kripa. Lord Baladev inculcates his muscle strength on him. Therefore, you are now moving, you are acting, you are doing. When you withdraw his strength, you think of. You cannot even lift your hand, or body will paralyze. You understand? You cannot even lift a blade of grass from the ground. When he withdraw his power, his muscle strength. You understand? And when he will get out from your body, this body is what? It's dead. It's a clump of matter only, nothing else. So Lord Maharaj inculcates his power unto you. You should understand this thing. This Lord for the power is merciful strength. You understand? Unless you get his mercy, you can't do anything. What to speak of? To appear Krishna, to make Krishna happy. You understand? Mm. So, then, second thing mm, is Namakaran. Naming ceremony is that. Nam karana ek sanska. Garvadhan, jat karma, then nam karana, anna prasana, like ten sanskaras are there, are Vedic sanskaras, purification ceremony. And this nam karana sanskar was taking place, Vasudev sent Gargamuni to go, 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 and do this sanskar. So Gargamuni came, he performed this nam karana sanskar, Baladev, so he gave this name. First he gave this name, his name is Ram. Ram. Because he will make everybody happy. Then Sukhi He will make everybody happy. All his relatives, those are related to him. He will make everybody happy. So, one of his name is Ram. Then he say, another name is Sankarsana. Because he is born by Garva Sankarsan. Then Saint Joga Maya attracts the womb of Devaki and placed it in that of uh, Rohini. So, the second name is Sankarsan. Third name is Balabhadra. Balabhadra 
And Joshua uh, Devi, mother of the affection was there, sort of mother of the affection, uh, automatically. Uh, the milk also emanates from their breast, and their hands will become sweat. So immediately take off their sons. Mm, Joshua takes off Krishna and Rohini takes off <laughs> Balaram <laughs> and allow them to suck to their breast. Uh, with that body, full body is uh, way to that mark. <laughs> <That's that. laughs> then gradually they grow up and the teething began. Little, little white teeth began to come out, you see, teething. Yes, they, they look like Kundo flower, Kundo Puspa. You understand? Have you seen Kundo Puspa? This is Varnana description of that. Look like Kundo flower. This <laughs> teeth when they're coming out. Uh, when these two mothers uh, used to see uh, their children, they become, you shall become so steady, become mad with the love, the motherly affection. Mm. And also sometimes they leave their children there in the courtyard and they are engaged in some work, some children, children or cooking or some else. So these two brothers are playing and, and uh, I say so, so some cows are sleeping, wolves are sleeping, some uh, calves are also sleeping there in the courtyard and these two brothers go there. And, and they manifest. This is you know, it's quite natural with the children. They are very naughty, naughty children. It's a childish wickedness. And so sometimes they go and catch hold of the uh, tail of the calf. The calf immediately gets off and kicks. <laughs> so they fall down and cry. And then two mothers run quickly. Oh, my child is gone. Such lila, they are manifesting. <laughs> this is a transcendental. Mm. Then they gradually grow up, they start as to stand up, stand up. You understand? <laughs> it's all human lila, you see. Stand up. First they catching, huh? just leaning against catching the wall, they began to stand up. Sometimes they fall down and cry, again they will <laughs> rise up, they stand, again fall down, again cry, and mothers come and take them up. This leader, they are manifesting. Mm. All the friends, relatives, they are keep and keep, mm. uh, seeing this transcendental childhood leaders of Ram and Krishna, they are so happy, so cheerful. They say, so steady, uh, they became mad, they forgot everything. Mm. Also, Balaram always helps Krishna in stealing butter, Makanchor. <laughs> is Makanchor, Krishna is Makanchor, steals uh, <laughs> Makan from the houses of Gopis, and Lord Balaram helps him. Mm. They, they have uh, put this. Parts of Makan in High Sika, what do you say, Sika? Sling. Sling. Huh? Sling. Sling. And Krishna cannot reach it. So, Moraram uh, lifts him up. All right, go, 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 bring, bring, bring. Lifts him up. Like this. <laughs> I'll say, and doing this. <laughs> Stealing Makan. <laughs> and Moraram is very intelligent, you see, uh, and he teaches him how to steal. Krishna is still <laughs> this way. He teaches Krishna how to steal. <laughs> you understand? So, you also know one day Jasada binds up Krishna. Isn't it? Suddhavavi just Brajeshwari Karai Bandha. It's Suddha. You see? Pure heart. Otherwise, who can bind up Krishna? Uh-huh. He's supreme personality of Godhead. This is not possible. Only a devotee can find Bhaktir Bhaktattam, Bhaktir Jitattam. That is the Dhamdhar Ashtadam. Huh? Isn't it? Dhamdhar means the times. That month, Kartik month, we do, we do. Bhaktir Bhaktattam, Bhaktir Jitattam. Only with the devotee, 
chant in this song. So he will put up some spread, no? like mother. Jai Balaram Jiu Ki, Balaram Jiu Ki, Suvad Bhakti Ki Ki Jai. The Prabhupada Maharaj Ki Jai. Ananta Kuti Vaishnava Ki Jai. Samaveta Bhakta Ki Jai. Mother wanted, and they saw the breast. That is first song by Krishna, so we can feel it. So he went back to the Hebrew planet. I said that. Then he said, Yes. This enemy will become friends if they will become Krishna conscious. The Mahaprabhu came, Prane no Mari Lokare. Mahaprabhu never killed anybody, never got thrown. In other incarnation, Krishna killed. States. So you cannot make Krishna appear. You cannot make Krishna appear in your heart. In other words, you understand? As long as you are blessed with the mercy of Lord Balaram, you cannot take part in the Janmashtami festival. What is it? Janmashtami Mahotsava. Krishna Janmashtami Mahotsava. Do you understand? Therefore, we first observe this. Then we observe that by great mercy of Balaram, then we observe the Krishna Janmashtami festival. This is the thing. Do you understand? Thereby, you will see Balaram today, you will glorify him, you will see Ravan Kirtan, you will chant from first times, you will give mercy, you understand, police, that's why you have mercy on me, so I will take part in the Grand Master, most of Krishna, make Krishna for you, you understand. This is Balaram. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Wow. Ten thirty minutes. What we have finished? Right. Yes. You said that the Lord Shiva is always in the state of Lord Sankarshan. Yeah, Sankarshan. Yeah. Uh, he also is in the state of Balaram. What? What? Yeah, yeah Sankarshan is the expansion of Balaram. I said that. Mura Sankarsa, Maha Sankarsa. <coughs> Maha Sankarsa, in Vaikuntha. Yeah. Lord Shiva meditates that Sankarsa. And they follow that Vaikuntha, Sankarsa. Chitra Dhritva, Sankarsa. That Sankarsa. That was Bhagavad Gita, Eva and Bhagavad Gita. 
Mm-hmm. Really, you didn't give the, uh, the translation to the song you sang now, so... Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. The song you sang, the last bhajan? Mm-hmm. The, 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 the translation. Last song. I sang, today? Yeah, yeah. translation. Mm-hmm. Oh, translation of that song. Mm-hmm. Then I saw. Most of the I chanted. Occasionally, no. Nature and Nature more Ram Damodar. Ram and Damodar. Yes, Ram and Krishna. Please dance. More you dance, the more I'll give you milk and cream and butter. You understand? Huh? The more you dance, the more I'll give you milk, cream and butter. You understand? I mean, I the keep acha, not arva. Some other gopi came and said, I, I am not seeing your dancing. Please dance again. again, again. <laughs> yeah? Golai Ganthiar, you money more ha. I'll put on a garland of gems around your neck. Please dance again, I have not seen. <laughs> the other gopi, please, I have not seen. Please dance again. They all are making them dance. Oh, it's very nice. Tata, tata, theya, theya, goli, nundurani. Nundurani. Vrishlamata. Please. Tata, tata. Then, Kare Tali Diya Nache Ram Jodhumani. Then, Balara, clapping and dancing. Ram Kanu Ore Mor Ore Ram Kanu. Mani Maya Jula Maje Jolmol Tanu. The two mothers putting them into cradles and swing, swing, and swinging them and singing this song. Mani Maya Jula, bedecked with money. That scene is bedecked with money, jewels. Later in, when they fall in jewels, and so in that swing, their body, when they fall in jewels, this is me like this. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah.